here with DJ Gay after a tough, hard-fought win over Temple. DJ, the game was so close. How were you guys able to pull it out? Um, that was a game that uh, could have gone any, uh, either way. And um, we were fortunate to have a little bit of luck on our side and uh, came out with a great win. Our, our, our bigs took over in the end. Uh, Billy Malcolm made, made big plays for us. And, um, you know, it was a hard-fought win. Talk about the atmosphere. Did it feel kind of like a home crowd for you? Uh, it did. It felt great. Uh, the fans are well appreciated. Um, you know, we couldn't do it without them. Uh, we, def we definitely noticed them, and um, it, it was nice to see all of them come out. You guys just got the first win in school in history in, in, in the tournament. Now you got the second win in, in school history. You're one of 16 teams left competing for a national championship. How does that feel? Uh, like a dream come true, uh, kind of surreal, um, it, but it feels, it feels good to still be a part of, of what's going on in, in history. Um, you know, the, 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 we're trying to get to the next step. Uh, it's another goal well checked off, and uh, we got a big one uh, coming up next week. Next week you're going to be in Anaheim. How nice is that going to be? You're going to be close to home, have a lot of friends, family there. Uh, that's going to be, uh, you know, couldn't ask for a better situation for us and, and this team. Uh, we expect more fans to come out, more people to come out and support us, and that uh, should be a fun environment to play in. One last question. At, at the start of the second overtime, Coach Fisher talked to you for about 20 seconds there, right before the start of the, uh, the second overtime. What did he say to you? Uh, he just said to make sure, uh, you know, to control the game and, and, and bring us home. All right, thanks.